Hi there, this is Jenna with Time to Pet. In this video, we'll be reviewing the client fields and pet fields sections in the company settings of your account. The client and pet field sections are where you can configure all of the information you collect about your clients and their pets. You can add new fields or you can edit the existing fields here. The goal is that every company can collect the information they need specific to their business. The form selector allows you to choose which forms custom fields you are configuring. You can toggle back and forth between client and pet fields tabs by clicking on them. In both client fields and pet fields, you can configure different groups of fields. A group is simply a visual grouping of a set of custom fields. Each form can have any number of groups, and you can use these to group a set of related fields logically. You can add a new group for your different fields, edit the group title, add a new field to the group, delete the group, and modify the display order of the group. To create a new group or make edits to existing groups, click Configure Groups at the top of the screen. To create a new group here, click the green Add Group button. A new group with no fields and a default title of new group will be created at the end of the form. To delete an existing group, click on edit to the right of the group name. Then click delete group. Deleting a group does not remove the fields that are inside of the group. If you remove a group that has fields inside of it, those fields will be automatically moved to the next closest group. To change the group's title, click edit next to the group's name and enter your changes. When you're done, click the blue Save Changes button or Cancel to exit without saving your changes. To change the order of a group, click and drag on the arrow button to the left of the group name, and then move your group to where you would like it to be in your new order. When you're done editing your groups, click the Back to Fields button at the top of the screen to add a new field to a group, scroll to the group's header row where the group's title is and click the green New Field button. Additional options will appear and you can specify the details of the new custom field. Let's go over how to customize some of the field details. A form field is used to collect a precise piece of information about a client. For example, you might have one field for the client's name, one for their phone number, and one for their email address. You can customize most of the default fields that come with Time to Pet and any custom fields that you create yourself. Please note that some of the default fields have a lock icon next to certain aspects when editing. This means you cannot change this aspect of the field. To edit a field's name, click the Edit button and enter your new field's name such as a food and water bowl location. Next, you can configure the field type. There are three field types, text box, text area, and yes or no. The text box option is for collecting shorter pieces of information, such as a client's phone number. The text area option is for collecting larger pieces of text, such as routine notes. And the yes or no option is for simply collecting a yes or no answer to a question. You can also change the values for your question here to be different from yes or no. You can adjust the preview text for any fields as well. This preview text is the hint that is shown to the client to let them know what information to enter in this field. You are also able to change the field size for your text box or text area. Custom fields can be configured so that they are hidden from the client or are visible but not editable by the client. To show a field but not let it be edited, uncheck the Client Editable option. To hide a field from clients, uncheck Client Visible. Fields can also be set as required if you want clients to be required to enter information here. 
You can also make it so that clients have to enter required information in order to make schedule requests. This option is available in the client settings section of your account under portal settings and force required fields for schedule requests. Fields can also be hidden from staff members who have the role of staff or trainee. To hide information from staff members, uncheck the staff visible option. When customer segment is checked, this field will be made available in the reporting section of your account under revenue. This can be used to segment your reports. Only text boxes are available to be marked as customer segment. To delete a custom field, click the Edit button on the fields row, and then the red Delete Field button. Custom fields can be reordered just like groups. Click on the arrow to the left of the fields row to drag and drop the field up and down. To move a field to a different group, simply click on the arrows to the left of the field's row to drag and drop the field into the desired group. Thanks for watching. If you have any additional questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at support at